Henry the Green Engine has lived on the island of Sodor for many years. He wouldn't want to be anywhere else. He likes every part of it, from the fields filled with flowers to the white sandy beaches. But there is one place that Henry always enjoyed visiting more than any other. His driver knew this too. Come on, Henry, he would say. We've made good time today. We'll stop for a while by the forest. Henry loved it here. The forest was full of broad oaks and tall pines. Henry always felt better for being here. He couldn't really explain why, but his driver understood. It's peaceful, he said to Henry. Keep your smelly freight away from my passengers, grumbled Gordon. Passengers and freight do not mix. And he wished away. When Henry got back to the sheds, the fat controller was waiting for him. A new machine for the toy factory has arrived. I want you to pick it up from Brendam Docks and take it to the factory as soon as possible. Henry grunted dreadfully. You'll just have to put up with it, Henry, said his driver. At least the extra load will mean you can have another engine help us up Gordon's Hill. Hurry up! I'm a busy engine, puffed Henry. Meanwhile, Duck was waiting at Edward's station so that he could help the heavy train by pushing from behind. Henry made good progress. When they reached Edward's station, his driver stopped the train beyond the platform. Duck buffered gently up to Henry's train. He was not coupled on. Henry would then be able to run on without stopping when they reached the top of the hill. Ready, whistled Duck, and off they set. Soon they reached Gordon's Hill. Push hard, push hard, puffed Henry. We're doing it, we're doing it, replied Duck. Henry was pulling his train harder than he realized. Thomas arrived just in time for the grand opening. It was a magical sight. There were colored lights, balloons, and lots and lots of toys. The Fat Controller declared the toy shop open for the winter holiday season. Everybody cheered. Thomas was so pleased to see the children's happy faces. You were right, Henry, Thomas tooted. In future, I shall leave pulling the heavy trucks to you. Now Henry can see the trees growing strong and tall, and the animals are coming back. Sometimes everywhere is quiet. At other times, Henry can hear leaves rustling or a bird's wing brushing the air. Often he can hear the sound of children laughing, and always he is happy here. <laughs>